the finishes. Mark Willing? We know he's about as good as anybody's. He actually tweeted afterwards. He said, just bring them down to your level, then pounce. <laughs> That's what he did against Ding. This is now best of nine, so we will have intervals. Hang Zheng Yi, of course, is a ranking event winner. He either but again he just floats those shots in so well this British Open two years ago when it was revived that's his most recent ranking title quarter final British Open to get nine today match Mark Williams was fan take what comes he's quite proud I think of winning ugly which is quite a good attribute to have This is an excellent chance to get sort of used to the surroundings or to sort of, as I say, settle into the match. They just they bang on it from shot one. Yes, a less cluttered event now. Even just upstairs in the practice. <coughs> Choosing the red in the middle just purely for positional purposes. Played on the one to left corner, but didn't get straight on it. That's so. nine. Village in this visit to the table. Absolutely pocket actually this week. No problem. 66. Yeah, nothing ugly or scrappy of start this match we want. A high break is still 136, Daniel. Shot harder than it needs to be hit. Nine. Not heavily anymore. I think this is okay. This will do. Nine. Sheer class from Mark Williams. I'm sure, Joanne is watching. Getting a bit of footage, maybe. 120. Well, if you're looking for inspiration, your own father. Is, uh, the perfect. 131. Just a glorious start to quarterfinals day. Next frame, frame number two. Remember, table two. Ego Quang against Hussain Vafai is available to watch live on the ITV Sport YouTube channel. And that will be the case tonight as well for Tom Ford against Xiao Gudong. About making them, he'd get to 80 and sort of not bother. So he, I think if he'd have carried on like he did there, he'd be nearer 800. Anybody along the way? One. Who above the black? 
leave the other one into the corner pocket. Looks pretty straightforward there. And believe me, this is tough. Ooh, it's a great pop. Okay, come on. Forty years at the Crucible, there was a big parade of former champions. He wasn't there. He didn't qualify that year. And he wasn't interested in going back and being part of it. Having contemplated even packing it in. Got the right contact on the pink. Again. Thirty-nine. Get the angle to go around the back of this red, as closest to the cue ball. Which obviously, but it's amazing how the very best players somehow just automatically kick into gear when you get to the business end of tournaments. One. Part of his appeal, and it's, it's actually a strength, isn't it? But that isn't missing those. It's one snooker needed, so snooker. Okay. Thirty-nine. 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 Yeah, you, you can't rattle one. Mark Williams. You can't snooker in South Wales. And they didn't treat him with kick gloves. <laughs> Nine. Yeah, two reasons for me. Didn't really want his opponent to come to the table and start potting balls again. his cue. So a little bit frustrated in his chair, Mark. You'll never know, of course, but he will be. 17. So, Fan, in the end, didn't get the chance to play. He's got to try and get in. Hasn't really done so yet. He tried that red to the green pocket in this frame. Didn't pot. Five. He made 68 from it. Because <laughs> last year, his uh, friend and coach, Lee Walker, was in the Champion of Champions. Fourteen. But, of course, if Mark were to win this... He'd be in this year's event in Bolton. Thank what you. a great addition he'd be to that. 25 and frame. So, Mark fine stuff to say, came when final. Very well played by Mark Williams in first two frames. 